it's important to start a chapter educational fund because chapter educational funds, what we call a CEF, CEFs are important because they elevate the chapter. If you want to start giving out scholarships to your undergraduates, that's what a CEF is for. If you want to pay for the registration costs for your undergraduates to attend an educational conference, if you want to host an educational conference, if you want to put together academic grants for your undergraduates, if you want to put together a scholarship or a grant program or a fellowship program for the alumni of your chapter to go get a graduate degree or go get a professional degree, that's what a CEF is for. It allows your chapter's alumni to give back to their particular chapter. The money sits within the National Foundation and you get to use the National Foundation's infrastructure for accepting credit cards, recurring payments, one-time payments, employer match. The foundation will make sure that it's allocated to your particular chapter. Some alumni get concerned. They think, well, I don't have $1,000 to donate. I don't have $10,000 to donate. You don't need that. You can donate $10, $20. We have many guys around the country who donate $18.97 to their CEF in honor of the fraternity's founding year. Any way you can give back to a CEF, it's important to try to do so. And most importantly, you should start one for your chapter because if you start one today, then just like a chapter grows over the years and the decades, a CEF can grow over the years and the decades too. It's really a partnership between the foundation and the chapter. Having that connectivity and partnership is important because the more you understand one another, the more you're going to be able to help one another because that's what the foundation and the operational side of the fraternity is for. You can learn more about starting a CEF by contacting any of the Educational Foundation trustees. You can contact anybody at our executive office, anyone on the Grand Council, anyone who's involved with the fraternity at the national level they can put you in touch with the right people to start a step for your chapter. We need everybody to be involved with the fraternity, to continue to give undergraduates a good experience, and then also give alumni a good reason to stay engaged and stay involved. And it, it really takes a, a group effort to make that happen.